Here's the difference between a good rotor and one that needs to be replaced. As you can see here, there's no abnormal groove marks or any rust buildup. This one happens to be brand new. On this one, that was actually just replaced today, you can see on the outside, there's a little bit of a rust ridge kind of on the inside and the outside of the rotor. Um, no big deal, really. I wouldn't be replacing uh, a brake rotor just for that. But then, if you roll over to the inside of that rotor, and that's where you can start to see some of the rotor material actually falling off. Um, and on this specific one, the inner pad was stuck, and that was at about a one millimeter, almost metal on metal. And at that point, you definitely want to be replacing your rotors because the pad's not making full contact with this whole rotor. Typically, you would want your pad to you know, be hitting kind of the same way that it is on this side, where it's you know, nice and flush all the way around. But then on this side, you start running into the issue of your brake not making full contact with the rotor, and that could give you issues with stopping. If you have any further questions, comment below.